How's it going, friends and family of the internet? We're not gonna lie to you. I forgot to hit record on the camera, the people cam, while we were playing this next game. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna react to it because it was quite the game. It was. You were very intense for the whole time. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna, we have this little intro here that we're doing and we're gonna live react to it. It's a game called When Ski Lifts Go Wrong. And yeah, so okay, it's starting. So it's a it's a it's a sandbox game basically where you get a choice between a uh, snowboarder, a skier, or uh what was the what's the middle one? Snowmobiler. Yeah. Snowmobiler. So or snow you may know them as snow machines. So here we go. We got uh, three levels that I had built specifically for the stream. Big Air, Dead Sled, and Step Your Game Up. Uh, we'll get to the names of them in a little bit, but what did we see here? Oh, right, so what's the, what's the Big Air one, Aiden? The Big Air is um, a snowboard in one where you like have to hit a jump and you can like twist or something, and, you, and it just brings you straight down to the, brings you down. The finishing, the finishing area. Yeah, so so what is what is ski lifts go wrong? You basically have a start point and end point? Yeah, anyway. It's like it's like not a competition game, it's like just for fun. Yeah, yeah, I agree. It's it's like a physics based downhill cruiser. Uh, so Aiden asked here, who's the guy in the corner? That's Greg Miller. I forgot I had loaded him up that he was in the game. He's from kinda of funny. Uh, they they do video games too. They have a comedy kind of channel and then they have uh, Kind of funny games, so I watched them anyway, and he put the code out and said like hey look I'm in the game then I forgot I loaded them in So anyways, we did the snowboard one here. You landed on your first try. You just rode down That's how I built this one it's supposed to be easy get you in the game Go down you can lift. Three four and death. <laughs> uh, so obviously you hadn't played this game before really at all. You were getting to know the controls, that's why you're like wiggling back and forth. You got the backflip down pretty good, and if I remember correctly. How many times was that? Nailed it! I don't know. We're gonna have to definitely <laughs> go back and check that out. As a matter of fact, yeah, we'll go back and check it out. Let's count this one because I think you really pushed it on this, this one. Was, too. Four. was that four? Yep, we crushed it. Uh, oh, here's you learning how to jump. That's right. Uh, before you weren't even jumping. Is that right? You were just going off the ramp. Yeah. Yeah. So that's possible uh, to do, and that's why this is a physics playground is because there's just like you know there's friction and it can go, like it just makes you go. Um, so I'm gonna just fast forward the video a little bit. We're going to oh, do a backflip on the ground. Yes. And this is the backflip from <laughs> learning the backflip to front flip. That was pretty great. And uh, so I, I built this. I built the levels to be snowboarding. Um, sledding and skiing so that way you can see all three vehicles and that was really great did you see you learned how to stop and then go we went ahead and we loaded up the next one the second level called dead sled called it that because you're probably going to crash the sled a bunch and turns out we did <laughs> yeah you, you crashed it you crash it a pretty good amount. What you have here is this is the sled and crash. Oh no, it's not a crash. But this one is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Get pinned in between the trees. Uh, so uh, you tried in first person mode here, and what? This is insane. I mean, first person mode is really crazy. It feels really intense. It's not a rocket though. You couldn't get to the sun. You, you couldn't get to the sun. That's all there was to it. 
so you try you try this for for quite a while. There are some pretty good deaths in this one, and what I'm gonna do is let them. I'm gonna let them run through in the video. We're just gonna let them play. We're gonna let them play out. Just do a time lapse of every time. And of course your sweet backflip lands. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna show those. So eventually what you ended up doing here was figuring out that there was a star on top of the cabin and in order to, because the point is still to get the metal and get the star, like, you know, you gotta get the metal, get the star. That's the whole point. So you learn to slow down and what happened? Slow down. You made it the, to the, the end. The twisty thing. The end. <laughs> and you backflipped off the finish line. <laughs> so yeah, you figured it out. That was the whole point. That was why I put that star there. It was really good. You really uh, figured it out. And then we said, okay, yeah, you got it. You nailed it. There were some good crashes. Let's move on to step yo game up. The name is an indication to the kind of jump that you were hitting. It's a, it's a called a step up jump where the the jump that you take off from is lower than the landing. Um, you hadn't quite figured out jump yet. Um, but then... This one took forever. Yeah, so you figured out how to preload the jump and you figured out how to reset the level really fast. <laughs> so we're gonna go through a montage. I'm gonna just let a montage run of all of the crashes and all the burns and all the learning process. went into the sandbox and we also moved around so sandbox means that you build these levels you can go into the sandbox and you can you move everything around I uh, built the mountains you know the jump and I put like I placed these portals at the end and that's the whole goal right is to get to these portals so tell them about the struggle like you had when you would like right here, it was getting easier to like jump off onto the cliff and like land on it. But those parts down there would always like throw you like backwards, and then you would like have to rebalance on the next hilly part. Mm -hmm. Like you would have to go a certain speed, or else you would over jump the little jump to get into the portals. Because mm -hmm. they and we actually had to like move it back a bit. Yeah. So we, you got to the point where you're getting really far getting to the portals and then we had to move the portals back. Um, I promise I didn't build this. I, I built it to be painful. <laughs> it was supposed to be hard. But I built them to, to be doable. But what we decided was we got to, we got so far down this, every every time we'd get to the portals almost, or get to the portals, we'd go over it, get to the portals, and uh, you would it would just be a miss because of the way the skier would land quick. and. So we moved the portals back in the sandbox mode. We got it once right there. Yeah, so you got through the portal one time, but it flipped you up, which was super weird. Who knows why that happened? And then let's just let's just live react to this one again, to to the ending. So then eventually you pulled off this 
clean. See, look at this run. Look at that. You were almost on your back when you went through the portal. And then pop, 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 pop. And there it was. Oh my God. It was so exciting. I'm sorry I forgot to record on the camera. I'm sorry, Aiden. That was the video for Ski Lifts Gone Wrong. Tell the people what they need to do. Subscribe, hit that go. Let's try to get 100 likes. 100 likes. That's not asking much. Come on, people. Share the video. Go to curledupup.com. You can get merch. We'll see you later.